Hi everyone, my name is Sean Bouchard and I'm one of the developers of Mission Admission. Today I'm going to show you a little bit about the game. Mission Admission is about helping a high school student get prepared for college. Specifically, you're going to need to guide your student through the process of preparing college applications, earning enough money to pay for college, and then preparing to excel when they actually get there. Uh, if you don't think you know enough about college to do this, don't worry, you'll learn more about it as you play the game. So let's get started. The first thing that we're going to do is pick the student that we're going to help out. Uh, and uh, in this case, I have a choice between Seth, Olivia, and Destiny. Seth wants to be an artisan woodworker, uh, comes from a two-parent household that's struggling financially. Olivia wants to be a biologist and comes from a single-parent household that is also struggling financially. And Destiny wants to be an entrepreneur and comes from a two-parent household with a low income. If, I'm, if I don't like any of these choices, then I can click this button to get more uh, stuff, but um, I like to choose a character based on their career ambitions, and um, I like animals, so I'm going to go with Olivia, uh, who wants to be a biologist. Hi, come on in. Okay, great. So there's Olivia, uh, and we're ready to get started. The first thing that I am going to do, because I know it's super important, is I'm going to look at the calendar and see what deadlines Olivia has coming up uh, here. Um, and uh, uh, here you can see on the calendar that all of these deadlines are, uh, are, are coming up in the game on different days. Mission and Mission takes place over the course of a week. Uh, and all of these deadlines correspond to real times. Um, so because I started the game on a Monday, uh, you can see that the calendar starts on Monday and it goes through Sunday, the end of the week. Uh, and um, all of these deadlines fall at different times during the day, sometimes you know, in the middle of the night at like 2 or 3 a.m. Um, I'm going to look at the first couple of deadlines that are coming up today uh, because I know that those are always uh, really good things um, that, uh, that don't really have a, a lot of requirements. So for example, if I click here, this is a college fair. Um, this is where Samantha... Uh, sorry, what's, 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 uh, what's my name? Olivia. I'm going to go back. This is where Olivia can um, can go to learn more about uh, different college options. Uh, and it doesn't have any requirements. If there were any requirements, they'd show up over here. All it costs is energy, uh, two energy. So I'm going to apply to that. And then I'm going to look at this. This is a college visit. So this is um, basically Olivia's opportunity to go out to a local school uh, and get a campus tour. Again, all of this... Uh, all this costs is energy. There are no requirements for it. So I'm going to apply for that because um, uh, those will give me bonuses just for having done them and they don't, they don't require anything from me. And then looking further down uh, the, the calendar, um, we can see there are a bunch of deadlines up here coming up. Um, and some of them, these circles, are different types of scholarships. So for example, this is a performing arts scholarship that will give me $20 uh, uh, or, or uh, yeah, that's not um, you know real money, uh, but uh, $20, $20 in, in the game. Uh, a technical arts scholarship will give me $50, so that's worth more. Um, and then these square ones are different colleges. So for example, this is a nursing school and its tuition is $80. So, uh, so I'd have to earn enough money to go there. Um, or this is the, uh, the popular state university. Uh, it also has a tuition of $80. Um, but I'm not ready, I don't think, to choose any of these deadlines yet. And I know that I've got uh, a little bit of time. I've got a day before anything comes up. So I'm going to spend a little bit of time getting to know Olivia a little bit better um, by clicking on her locker down in the corner. Uh, we already know that Olivia wants to be a biologist, uh, but... Um, here's what's important about that is that uh, Olivia has the opportunity to earn badges. 
based on her career ambition. Uh, one of them is Scientific Mind, uh, which she would earn by leveling her tech arts score up to level four. The other is Student of Nature, uh, which she would get by leveling her academics to level four. Um, Badges are really important in mission admission. Uh, they basically determine how successful a student is going to be uh, at the end of the week when they actually go off to college. And every game of mission admission, you have the opportunity to earn five badges. Two of them come from the student's career ambitions, and three of them come from the college that they enroll in. We don't know yet where Olivia is going to go to college, um, but we do know that uh, she wants to be a biologist, so we can get started working on these uh, badges and try to, to make some progress towards earning them. So let's do that now. Um, let's go check out what uh, extracurricular activities are available at uh, Olivia's school. And we do that by clicking on the building icon down here and then choosing a room that we want to go to. Uh, so I remember, for example, that uh, one of Olivia's badges uh, towards being a mad scientist uh, involved um, tech. So I'm going to go to the tech workshop. Uh, what was that? That was just tech arts at level four. So each room has its own stat, uh, which is, uh, in this case, is tech arts. Uh, and then there are also five different skills that you can practice by uh, engaging in different extracurricular activities in that room. Um, so, for example, this is uh, computer programming. Um, uh, or electronics, uh, sorry, uh, and this is uh, like automotive, um, this is cooking, uh, culinary arts. Um, for Olivia, uh, it doesn't matter so much which of these specific skills uh, she engages in. Um, she just wants to become really, really good at all kinds of tech stuff. So. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna use this station here that represents um, electronics, uh, like an electronics club at the high school, uh, maybe, and um, have her come over here and and spend some time doing that. You see, every time I click on this, a uh, couple of things happen. One is uh, this little star pops out that represents that Olivia's earning experience points. Um, one is that this up here. Uh, the um, electronics uh, stat uh, increases, levels up. So you see it just went to level two, and now it's starting to level up from there. Another thing is that the tech arts uh, bar fills up a little bit every time you click on it, right? And so then that levels up to level two. And then the third thing that happens is Olivia actually spends energy doing this, uh, which means that um, she uh, can only do so much of any activities uh, before she runs out of energy and, um, and we need to wait a little while and come back and check on her later. Um, so a lot of this game is going to be balancing uh, trying to do all of these activities and level up all of these stats and then looking at the calendar and recognizing that uh, you have to get things done in time to actually apply to the deadlines that you want to apply to. So we've done some good for Olivia. Her tech arts is at level two uh, and her electronics um, is at level three. It's leveled up quite a bit. Um, so let's go back and look at the calendar and look at what colleges and scholarships Olivia might be interested in. Um, I'm just going to go through here uh, and look at sort of several of these. So this is, um, this is a triathlon, uh, and for the triathlon uh, requires sort of a skill uh, in athletics that's up to level two and right now I don't have any Olivia doesn't have any athletic skill so that doesn't seem like it's a great fit necessarily um, this is another scholarship for liberal arts um, and that requires uh, that your liberal arts score be at two and that you have a letter of recommendation um, 
but that's a fairly hefty scholarship. That that would be fifty dollars if I could get it. Um, what else is there? There's this. Hey, look, this is a technical arts scholarship. This requires uh, two things. It requires that you have uh, tech arts uh, at level two, which I have. Uh, Olivia has leveled up her tech arts all the way to level two. Um, and uh, that you have a letter of recommendation. And I don't have that yet. So if I try to apply to this, it's not gonna let me. But uh, we can fix that actually. I'm, I, I think this is really worth uh, uh, applying to, having Olivia apply to. So I'm gonna star it. And you see, I just clicked on the star here uh, and now it's got a little orange star next to it. Um, and let's, let's keep going for a minute. I'm gonna look at this. This is a trade school. Um, trade school has a requirement of tech arts and academics. Uh, I've already met the tech arts requirement and uh, the academics requirement is, um, isn't is too high. And I know that Olivia wants to uh, put some time into academics anyway, because that's uh, one of her badges. Um, so this seems really promising. I'm gonna star this. Um, this is internet college. Uh, so this is a, um, uh, a college that is looking for academics, requires letters, uh, and also an essay. Um, that also seems uh, potentially useful. Um, the FAFSA, the Free Application for Federal Student Aid, um, this is, I'm definitely only going to star this uh, because again you can see there are no requirements for this, although it does require quite a bit of energy to, uh, uh, to apply to it um, because there are a lot of forms that you have to fill out, uh, but it's worth it because uh, you can get uh, uh, a financial aid from the government if you fill out the FAFSA. Um, so I'm going to star that. Um, then what else do we have? Uh, I'm just looking forward at some of these things. I know that this is nursing school uh, and that also has a tech arts and academics component. So I'm going to star that. Um, let's see, the popular state school. Uh, has a focus on academics and athletics uh, and I don't know Olivia probably is going to be spending too much time in the tech workshop to get a lot of athletic stats up so maybe not that one um, how about this though this is technical academy so this has a really high uh, requirement for tech arts um, and a slightly lower one for academics, but it still seems very, very in line. And honestly, if Olivia wants to be a mad scientist, Technical Academy uh, seems like maybe it's a, it's the place that she really wants to go. Um, so that seems like a good, uh, a good choice. Um, and then uh, let's see, are there any other? Um, well, I want to look at this community college. So uh, community college uh, is affordable and doesn't have a lot of uh, requirements. Um, so uh, I'm going to star that just kind of as a, as a fallback, as a safety. Um, and now I can click on this to clear my whole calendar of everything except for the things that I've highlighted and uh, and that helps me sort of focus in on on the stuff that I know Olivia cares about so in this case I can see there are, are several schools that um, uh, I think might be a good fit for Olivia and that's great uh, it's a good idea for her to, to apply to more than one school because um, uh, she might not get into the to the school that she really wants to go to, uh, which is this technical academy. Um, and I have a couple of scholarships, a couple of opportunities to earn some college money for Olivia, uh, but um, but not a lot. So I'm actually going to look at this again. 
uh, and see are there any opportunities to maybe put in for a scholarship in the next two days before I have to really um, be applying to all of these other things. Uh, and here's something that I noticed. This is the liberal arts scholarship. Um, and these are my liberal arts to be at two. Um, how about this one? This is a poetry contest. Um, this is a smaller award, but it's still uh, something. Um, and this is a triathlon. Uh, what's this? Fine arts scholarship? So I could go into fine arts or liberal arts or athletics, it seems like. Um, and uh, and have an opportunity for a couple of uh, of scholarships. Um, this one uh, requires a lot of uh, of things. It requires two letters of recommendation um, and an essay, uh, but it only requires level two in student government. Um, and the reward is quite high. Um, I don't know if Olivia's gonna have time to apply to this, but uh, here's what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna star that. And then I know that um, student government is part of uh, the writing, um, which you can sort of, uh, if you're not sure where things are located, you can go to these different rooms and uh, uh, actually, the easiest way to do it is probably to um, to go to the store, uh, and then you can see all of the major category categories. There's athletics, fine arts, uh, writing or li um, liberal arts, uh, technical arts, uh, community service, and academics. Um, and if I go here, I can see that uh, there's. Um, there's a debate podium uh, under the uh, the writing section, um, and then there's an upgraded debate podium, uh, and those will help me uh, upgrade my um, student government. Uh, so I'm going to go back to the calendar, sort of knowing that I'm going to star this deadline, and then what was the other liberal arts deadline? It was this one, the liberal arts scholarship. Um, I'm going to start that too. So now let's look at our calendar. Um, so now we've got a couple more scholarships that are on our radar, and that's good. I know that this one's kind of a reach, um, but I'm going to I'm going to try to get this one. Um, and then in the meantime, I'm going to be leveling up uh, my tech arts to try to get this one as well. Those are my two big scholarships that I'm going after. And then the uh, and then obviously the FAFSA. And then the school that I want to get into is technical arts, um, but I have a couple of fallback schools, nursing school and the internet college and uh, this trade school, um, as well as a community college at the end of the week. Um, so I've got about two days to prepare for uh, this liberal arts scholarship, um, but but then I don't have a lot of time after that. I only have one more day before this long run of, uh, of deadlines that I have to be ready for. So I got to plan ahead for all of those. Um, so the first thing that I'm going to do is I saw that some of the upcoming uh, deadlines that I have picked out require letters of recommendation. Uh, so I'm going to go back to Zoe's room where I'm able to request letters uh, from um, the, uh, the teachers who lead the different activities that I'm involved in. Right now I'm involved in this electronics club um, at level three, uh, which is a pretty decent level. Um, it's not amazing. Levels go all the way up to five, uh, but three shows that I've put in, um, you know, a, a, a good amount of work so far. So I'm going to click on that. Um, and you can see now that there's 12 hours uh, before that letter is ready. There's, you need to remember to request letters of recommendation uh, 
early in advance of the deadlines where you want to, uh, to use them. So I'm gonna get that started right now, get that started early, because I know it's gonna take some time. Um, and then I'm gonna go to the store and I'm going to look at the writing room and actually buy this debate. That cost me um, two pride points, which is represented by these little trophies. And pride points are hard to come by, but you start out with eight of them um, so that you uh, can um, upgrade your rooms to have some of the things that uh, that your characters want. So that's what's going to allow me to, to get some points in student government. Um, and On the other hand, let's do that right now. On the other hand, on the other see, hand, I'm just I'm clicking On this the other hand. and getting experience. On the other hand, and my student government is already up at uh, level two. On the other um, hand, but I know that I want to get my liberal arts up On to the level other two. Hand. So I'm gonna do at least that much. And now how am I doing? I got liberal arts at level two and I've got my debate, my uh, my student government at level two. Let's look at the calendar and look at this. Liberal arts is at level two. I need a level, letter of recommendation, but I've got one uh, cooking. I've got one that's, uh, that's getting ready. Um, so I'm doing okay here. Uh, and then looking at this technical arts scholarship, my tech arts is already at two. I'm going to need a second letter of recommendation. I don't quite have that uh, ready yet, but um, but maybe actually my uh, student government could be that second letter of recommendation. So um, how much energy do I have? I have seven energy left. Uh, I wonder if that's enough to get this all the way up. Let's let's try on it. The let's see. Hand, on the other 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 Look at that. So I got my student government up to level three, uh, and I have two energy left. I'm gonna spend that energy Hi. going back to in. Zoe's room and requesting a second letter of recommendation from uh, debate from the debate club. Um, that's going to be about all that I can do. <laughs> okay, so uh, I definitely made a mistake uh, looking at these. Let's see. Let me go back to the calendar. Uh, let me look at the deadlines that I had starred. This one is uh, student government. The student government icon is this little uh, pillared building, um, like a like a government building, uh, and that is actually this. That's different than debate. Um, so uh, you know what I'm gonna do? Uh, Olivia has been doing really good work. Um, but I'm going to take this young leader scholarship off of, of her radar uh, and um, instead I'm going to look at this poetry contest. I know I don't have a lot of time to get ready for that because I'm, I'm pretty much out of energy right now. Uh, but um, if I can get poetry just up to level two, my liberal arts is, is already better than the minimum requirements for this, uh, for this scholarship. So I might, I might, I might be able to get this. Uh, and then I still have a little bit of time before I need to be ready for all of these deadlines. Um, so the last thing that I'm gonna do then is over here, uh, I am going to look at, uh, what can I, what can I get for poetry? It's this, um, that comes down here, I'm just going to start working on that. Was really, and so you can see my poetry has gone up just a little bit. It's at level one, um, and uh, my liberal arts is well into level two, and I am now out of energy. So um, I'm actually going to take a break from this and come back uh, tomorrow. Let's see, when are... Uh, do I have any deadlines tomorrow? I have a deadline tomorrow at 6 p.m., so I just got to make sure that I come back to the game before 6 p.m. tomorrow, and then I can uh, I can apply to this uh, before that deadline passes. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take a break here. And
and uh, and come back uh, tomorrow. Okay, here we go. Uh, so it is now Monday. Let's look at the calendar. Uh, it's Monday. Um, we can see the poetry contest that I want to apply to is still coming up uh, in a couple of hours. Um, so that's great. I have time to apply to that. Uh, and we've gotten some new mail from the two activities that we responded to uh, yesterday. So the college fair um, uh, sent us uh, a message and, uh, and we got a pride point for um, having attended that and looking at the college visit, same thing. We got another pride point for having done that. Uh, so that's great. Good job, Olivia. Uh, I had four pride points and now it's up at six. And uh, I have 54 energy uh, because it's been a while since I uh, checked into the game. Um, so uh, let's go back and look at this poetry contest. What does this require? I need to get my poetry up to two uh, and then I can apply to it. And then this liberal arts scholarship, uh, I'm, I'm, in, I'm sitting pretty in terms of liberal arts, although if that went up to three, it would actually help my chances of getting the scholarship. Uh, and I also need a letter of recommendation. Uh, and then looking even further forward, this tech arts scholarship, I need a second letter of recommendation. Uh, but other than that, I'm, I'm already meeting the requirements. So that's all good. Um, let's look at our letters of recommendation. Uh, and it looks like we've got two of them, right? Because we, uh, we requested these yesterday uh, and more than 12 hours has passed. Um, so we have one from electronics uh, that's at level three and one from debate that's at level three. Um, so that's good. We've got two letters of recommendation to work with. Uh, I am going to go back to the writing room and work on poetry because uh, I want to get that up to level two. Twas brillig and ye. Okay, and now I could keep working on some of this in order to level up my liberal arts, which would really help my liberal arts scholarship. Um, but I don't want to spend too much energy in the um, in the writing room because that's not what Olivia wants to do. Uh, Olivia really wants to to be a, a great at tech arts and also at academics. Um, so I'm going to go back to the tech room. Over here. Um, and my electronics is is going well. Uh, I think Olivia is really going to focus in on electronics because right now she's at level three. Um, but uh, the more time and energy she puts into uh, this activity, the better the letter of letters of recommendation that she can get um, from uh, from advisors who have seen her here. So I'm going to keep working on this a little bit. You can see at level three, uh, it becomes a lot um, harder to level up. It takes a lot more work to get from level three to level four. Uh, but I can see I'm actually going to level up my tech to level three, and then a couple more energy, I will level up electronics to level four. And I feel really good about that, where that is right now. Uh, so let's look at the calendar, and again, we can look at the, the deadlines that we're really focused in on. I'm ready for this. I meet all of the requirements, and I exceed the requirements here. Um, poetry contest, uh, just because I apply to this doesn't guarantee that I'm going to get money from it. Um, I actually have to be uh, good enough uh, that, um, that I can earn that. So uh, just meeting the minimum requirements isn't always enough. Uh, it really helps if you can um, show that you are uh, uh, a 
especially good in in uh, in the things that they care about. So the fact that I have more than enough, more than the minimum requirement in liberal arts is really good. I'm gonna apply to this and spend six energy on it. And then looking ahead, I'm gonna, uh, I think I'm gonna apply to this too, this liberal, liberal arts scholarship. So I have uh, these two um, letters. And I'm gonna apply the debate, level three debate uh, letter to this scholarship. And now uh, I meet all of the requirements for this. And I'm gonna apply to that and spend that eight energy. And now I know I have, I actually have two days uh, before my next thing. So I have a little bit more time to prepare. Um, and uh, and that's good. Um, one thing that's probably worth doing Hi. is going Come back to Zoe's room and looking at the letters of recommendation that I can request. So um, I already have a letter of recommendation from Electronics, but it's at level three, and my Electronics has, is now at level four. So um, I can request uh, another letter of recommendation from that, and uh, and when I get that, that'll actually be uh, a better letter. Um, and I can also request, I'm gonna request another one from Debate, uh, because um, uh, that's that's a reasonably high uh, rank, my level three in debate, and um, and I'm probably gonna need letters of recommendation when these deadlines come up. So, um, and then let's see, let's see what I've applied for both of these things. Um, I need a letter of recommendation for uh, this tech arts scholarship. Uh, and then the next thing that I'm looking at is Internet College. And Internet College requires uh, another letter, um, an essay, uh, so I can go work on that. Um, and also uh, academics needs to be at level two. Um, and just to stay focused, I'm going to look at the school, the REACH school, uh, Olivia's uh, school that she really wants to get into. Um, and that also requires tech arts. I've met that requirement. It requires academics, but only at level one. So if I can exceed this, that'll really help my chances of getting in here. And then I'm probably going to want to save my best letter of recommendation, the best one that I can get for this school. Um, so just keeping all of that stuff in mind. Uh, let's see, on Thursday, I have three deadlines that I need to look at including trade school, which also wants academics, and it wants another letter. So I need to make sure that I have enough letters to send to all of these schools. Uh, and then here's the other thing is that on Thursday, I only have these three deadlines, but the FAFSA is due on Friday at 2 a.m. So I'm going to need to apply to that on Thursday, or I will definitely miss that deadline because I'm not going to be... Uh, uh, coming and playing this game before 2 a.m. on Friday. Um, all right, so it looks like I've got uh, a bunch of stuff on my plate, um, and academics is probably the thing that I should, uh, that I should go work on. So this is the library, and there are a couple of things that I can do in the library. Um, one of them is actually uh, work. Uh, as uh, doing at the at the sort of um, the front desk of the library, and when I do that, uh, I actually earn money that can go towards college. Uh, however, um, that's all I get. I don't get any experience uh, from doing that, uh, and so it's a good way to cover. Um, sort of a little gap in the amount of money that you've got, um, but it's not the best way to earn college money, and and um, uh, because it it uh, it earns it fairly slowly, like it costs a lot of energy, and it also um, uh, doesn't help you in any other ways. Uh, uh, 
but it doesn't help you level up your other skills. So for example, if instead of working in the library, I were to just study in the library, then uh, my academics stat would go up. The library is different from all of the other rooms because uh, there, are, uh, there aren't specific skills um, that you're leveling. Uh, it's really just um, the amount of time that you spend studying. Your, your grades are treated as sort of a single uh, score. That's just your academic score. So let's go back and look at this again um, and look at, uh, for example, here we go, Internet College. Now I meet this uh, requirement. So that's good. I'm in good shape there. Um, probably I come back. Hi. Come on in. But first let's look at essay writing. So um, essay writing, uh, basically I need to, uh, to write uh, an essay that I can send in with uh, my application to several of these colleges. And the better the essay that I write is, um, the, the better it will reflect on me uh, when I send it in. Um, now, I haven't uh, sort of noticed this before, but as I've been doing other activities, as I've been, um, uh, you know, studying, uh, raising my academics, working in the um, electronics club, and raising my uh, my tech art score. Um, occasionally, I've gotten these personal stories, and personal stories represent something that um, you know happened to you that was notable, that was significant, that meant something that um, you can write about in your uh, in your essay. So uh, I actually get to um, write three times spending these personal stories and it doesn't cost me any energy um, like that. But now I'm out of personal stories so now when I write it is going to cost me energy to do that. It's leveling up my essays uh, uh, which my essay is now at level two. Okay I'm gonna, I only have four energy left so I'm gonna just check and see is there anything else that I really want to do before I uh, before I spend that. Um, I have an electronics letter that I could send in with this. Oh, this is my level three letter, right? Level three? Yeah. So I'm gonna, uh, that sounds good to me. That seems like a good thing to put in here. Um, but I don't have eight energy, so I can't actually apply to this. But I am all ready to apply to the Technical Arts Scholarship, which is great. And then look at Internet College. So I don't have any letters to, to put into this. Um, but I do have my essay is doing well. Um, so that's good. And then Trade School. I also need a letter for this. Uh, and FAFSA, I just need some energy to spend and I don't have it. So let's go back. Um, uh, wait, let me look at my, uh, my dream school, Technical Academy. It cares about academics and tech arts. I just barely meet the requirement for tech arts, so it'd be good to level that up. And academics uh, is is still fairly low, so um, I could have, I could probably level that up a little bit further. The other thing that I can do, uh, and I, I haven't gotten into a school yet, so I don't want to commit too much, but I can look at the three badges that would be available to me if I uh, enrolled at Technical Academy. Um, because honestly, Technical Academy is uh, early in the morning on, is due in the morning on Sunday, uh, and then the game ends at the end of the day on Sunday. So um, if I get into Technical Academy, I'm not going to have a lot of time uh, after that to, um, to work on these badges. I would want to have these uh, like pretty well sorted out even before I apply. Um, so three tech activities at level four, that's a good one to know. Right now, um, I really just have the one. Uh, academics at level four, I'm not there yet, but I have been thinking about increasing my academics some more. Um, and then a letter of recommendation at level five, which means that I need to have some activity that's at level five 
uh, and um, uh, enough time before the end of the game to uh, to request a letter of recommendation for it. Um, so that sounds good. I think what I'm going to do is maybe branch out my tech activities and uh, and try to get my electronics up to level five because I'm already. Uh, level four. I'm getting close to that. And then um, continue working on my academics uh, and hope uh, that I can get into this school. So let's take a look at what other uh, activities are available in tech arts. There's programming, uh, auto shop, uh, chemistry, and cooking uh, that I do not yet have. Um, so I am going to select, what, wait, 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 what does Olivia want? Olivia wants to be a biologist. So with that in mind, um, I think chemistry is probably really worthwhile for her. Uh, and, um, and that's all I can afford, actually. So, uh, I don't have any, I don't have enough pride to, uh, to buy any other, any other, uh, things right now. Um, so, I am going to keep working on my electronics. Just with the energy that I have left. Um, and then uh, I'm gonna come back uh, tomorrow. Uh, let's see. Uh, I wanna come back tomorrow, but I actually don't have any uh, specific deadlines tomorrow. So I just wanna come back when I have some more energy uh, and, um, and can keep working on this stuff. Uh, so that's what I'm gonna do next. Okay, it is now uh, Wednesday morning, um, and uh, let's see how we're doing here. So I have a, a deadline coming up, but I've already applied for it. It's already taken care of. So I just, over the next day, need to prepare for all of these things that are coming up. And I'll tell you, I know that the one that uh, I don't want to forget about is the FAFSA, and uh, uh, and that's last in the line. I don't want to run out of energy uh, before I can apply to that. So I'm going to apply to that right now, just first thing. Get it out of the way. Uh, and then uh, I am looking at uh, this technical arts scholarship that I am completely prepared for. Uh, so I will, uh, but I'm going to hold off applying to that actually, just in case I'm going to take a look at my tech art score and see if it's possible that that could increase. And then I need a, a letter of recommendation for this and a letter of recommendation for this. So I'm looking for two letters of recommendation uh, and then um, I can start applying to these things. Uh, let's see what I've got here. Oh, I heard back from the poetry contest. And uh, I, I won. Uh, Olivia won the poetry contest and got $20 worth of scholarship money uh, in addition to a pride point. Um, so that's fantastic. Now I have some more pride. Uh, and I also uh, have uh, quite a bit more money uh, towards my scholarship fund. Um, of course, looking at any of these colleges, uh, this one costs 60, this one costs 80, and the one that I really wanna go to costs 100. Um, so I'm still a ways away from being able to afford any of those. Um, all right, so let's go to the tech workshop where I now have uh, two stations. Um, and I am going to, uh, I'm going to see if I can get this. Oh, you know what? It's probably, it, it's smarter to, uh, no, I'm going to double down on it. I'm going to keep working on this because if I can get this to level five, I can get a really, really good letter of recommendation. Now I know that I need to, uh, have some other tech arts, 
uh, skills that are leveled up uh, if I want to get badges from technical attacks, but I still have some time to do that, and this letter of recommendation would be so useful. I'm keeping an eye on my energy because I do want to make sure that I have enough time to, uh, to request letters of recommendation. Um, but I absolutely do. I've got uh, 16 more energy and my tech is up to uh, level 5 uh, and my tech arts is almost at level 4. So you know what? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go start in on the chemistry uh, and, and try to get my tech to level 4. Look at that. Uh, and I just earned a badge. So let's, let's look at uh, Olivia's locker and see her scientific mind was to get tech arts to level four and we just accomplished that so that's great that's good for Olivia she's got one out of the five possible badges that she can earn uh, during the game um, I also want to get academics to level four I forgot about that so that's that's gonna drive me to uh, to keep working on that um, and then now let's look at the calendar and uh, look at this next thing. So my tech arts, that paid off because it's now at four, um, where the minimum requirement is only two. Uh, so that's great. Um, I'm going to apply to this. It costs eight energy, uh, which I have 12. So that'll give me a, a few more energy that I can then spend looking at my... Come on letters in. of recommendation uh, and uh, here we go I've got electronics at level five so I definitely want to request a letter for that and um, I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and request another letter uh, for debate uh, just so that I, I have plenty of letters um, going forward um, okay, and uh, and yeah, I think that's all that I need to do today. Uh, oh, I still have two energy, so you know what? Let's go to the, uh, the library, this is a library. And, uh, and spend it here and start working on getting that academics up to level four. Um, there we go. Uh, and, um, and then I guess the last thing is that I noticed. Hi, come on in that I got some personal stories uh, that dropped so I can write on my essay for free uh, for a couple of points. I'll do that. And then, uh, yeah, I think that's it. So um, I need to come back. Uh, let's see. I just need to make sure that I'm back before 6 p.m. tomorrow because I'm, uh, I'm covered until then. I've already applied to this and I've already applied to this. Uh, and then I need uh, I need to make sure that I can apply to both of these schools. Um, uh, so I need to I need to come back to the game before six tomorrow. So I'll do that, and um, uh, I'll be back I'll be back then. Okay, it's Thursday, and uh, I'm excited because I know that there are. Uh, there's some school uh, applications coming up um, real soon here uh, that I gotta make sure I apply for, but I, I have time. I still have time to do that. Um, so the first thing that I'm gonna do is I see that I got some mail uh, from, uh, let's see, both of these things, the liberal arts scholarship that I applied to, and, uh, and Olivia uh, got that. Uh, Fifty dollars uh, of scholarship money, and um, she's been awarded a pride point. And then she also got this technical arts scholarship uh, for another fifty dollars and another pride point, which is uh, fantastic um, because now she has uh, enough scholarship money uh, to afford the tuition at um, the college that she really wants to go to. I don't need to worry so much about uh, uh, scholarships uh, now at this point. Now I've already applied for the FAFSA, uh, and that's probably a good idea because. Um, uh, this tuition cost 
actually doesn't cover all of the costs associated with attending the school. Um, so I don't know yet exactly how much it's going to cost to uh, to provide for um, potentially housing and moving and school supplies and all of that stuff. Um, uh, so it's a good thing that I applied for the FAFSA, um, but, uh, but I, I don't need to stress too much about Olivia's college fund at this point, because she did really, really well on some of those scholarships. Um, but let's look at what we are doing. We are looking at Internet College. Uh, Internet College is, I'm doing all right. My essay is okay. Uh, my academics are... Um, uh, are fine. They're they're sort of at the minimum. Um, I don't have a letter, uh, but let's see what what could I put in here. Um, this is my level four electronics. I have a level three debate, and I have a level five electronics. Uh, and let's see what I have that requires letters of recommendation. I know that one of those level fives I'm going to want to save for Technical Academy, but I can keep requesting more of them. I have some time before that. Um, so uh, nursing school requires two letters of recommendation. Um, so uh, that seems fine. I'm just going to choose between these. Trade school, uh, look at this. I've already earned one of the badges uh, that, um, that would be applicable if Olivia went to this school. So that's good. And, uh, and I have uh, a lot of money right now, so I feel good about being able to keep uh, $10 uh, after all of the costs associated with going to college. And then um, academics at level five, I know I wanna up my academics and they're not there right now, but, uh, but I feel like I could do that. So this seems like a really good fit for Olivia. Internet college seems okay, um, but not quite as good. She hasn't done any programming yet, and she hasn't done any athletics, uh, so it'd be harder for her to be really well prepared for internet college. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm still going to apply to this, uh, but I'm going to apply with uh, my debate letter, like that. Um, and then for this one, I'm going to apply my electronics letter. Um, and I'm actually not going to apply to either one yet, because both of them require uh, academics. And I'm going to see if I can level my academics up a little bit more. So I'm just gonna I'm gonna click on this for a little while. Let's we'll see if we can get academics at least to three. Uh, yeah, that's gonna be easy. Let's see if we can actually get it to four with the energy that we have. And you can see I'm actually I'm getting some additional drops. So I got some personal stories uh, and and things while I was doing this. I, I'm starting to run out of energy, but I think I'm gonna have enough. <gasps> Oh no. All right, well, so that was good because uh, now I've gotten my second, Olivia's second uh, ambition badge. Uh, she's, she's doing really well in terms of uh, uh, fulfilling, preparing to, uh, preparing for her career as a biologist. Um, uh, but let's see, I, I only have 12 energy left. Uh, this costs four and this costs eight. So I can apply to both of these schools, um, but then I uh, will be out of energy and won't be able to request any letters of recommendation. Um, actually, you know what I see? Uh, I will get more energy in, uh, in, in a minute. So if I, uh, if I get 13, uh, then I will be able to Hi. Come on in. go over here uh, and um, what do I do? 
I'm gonna I'm gonna prioritize applying to these schools because uh, I wanna I have some time then before uh, the next thing that requires letters of recommendation and I only need three more um, so I think I'm actually I'm good on letters of recommendation I'm gonna apply to internet college and I'm gonna apply to grade school and then uh, I'm gonna come back uh, tomorrow um, but I actually don't have any deadlines remaining tomorrow so I will be in a good position to uh, prepare for uh, this nursing school and technical academy uh, deadlines that uh, that I know are coming up uh, that I want to make sure I get to um, oh and I earned an extra uh, energy here so I'm gonna spend that uh, let's see, my electronics is level five and I can request another letter for that. So I'm gonna do that. Um, and that spends all of my energy. Uh, so I'll be back, uh, let's see, I'll come back tomorrow. Uh, just sometime tomorrow. I don't have, I don't have to worry about time pressure. Okay, fantastic, here we are. Uh, it's Friday now, um, and uh, a bunch of these deadlines have passed. Uh, so I should get letters from uh, from these schools and from the FAFSA. Um, and uh, I don't have anything immediate, but um, sometime before the end of the day tomorrow, I need to apply for nursing school, and then I need to also apply for this technical academy because again, that's a deadline that's at 2 a.m. on Sunday. Which is uh, which I'm gonna miss if I don't if I don't do it uh, tomorrow. So let's look at our mail uh, and Internet College starting out. So Internet College accepted us. Um, Olivia uh, uh, can go to Internet College, and I can actually enroll right here. Uh, trade school also accepted Olivia. That's fantastic because uh, that means that um, she's got some options now. Trade school uh, is a pretty good uh, backup school. Um, Olivia, I think, would fit in pretty well there. Um, so we still have our uh, our reach school, the school that, that we're really hoping that she gets into. So I'm not going to enroll in trade school yet, uh, but that's fantastic news. That... that that means that uh, we don't have to stress too much about getting into any schools. And the FAFSA awarded Olivia a financial aid package worth $80 uh, in addition to a pride point. So um, we now have plenty of money to go to any of the schools that we want to go to. We've got 12 pride points uh, and um, uh, we're looking at nursing school and technical academy. Uh, I also have a um, uh, an activity that's at level five. Uh, so I'm just gonna I'm gonna jump in right here. I'm gonna uh, request another letter of recommendation at level five because that's the highest letter of recommendation that you can get. I want to make sure that I have some of those that I can apply to uh, to some of these schools. Um, and then let's look at actually uh, I'm gonna look at Technical Academy. Uh, so Olivia is prepared for two of these. Um, badges if she gets into Technical Academy and enrolls there. Um, the only one that she's not ready for is Tech Wizard, uh, which is having three tech activities at level four. So that's something that I think might be worth working on. Um, nursing school is also really good. The, the badge that she doesn't have is service at level four. She doesn't have any service right now. So um, that's gonna be a tough one to get to. But actually, I think because, uh, because Olivia got into trade school, this might be her backup um, and this involves academics at level five uh, so you know what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna take nursing school off the table um, and uh, 
And now the only deadlines that I have left to worry about are Technical Academy and uh, this community college at the end of the week. Um, and for Technical Academy, really I'm, I'm looking at these tech activities. Uh, and then for trade school, it would be academics at level five. So um, those are the two things that I think Olivia should work on. Um, sorry, I need to look at that again. What was for trades for uh, technical academy? It was three tech activities at level four. So right now we've got one at level five, which is great, and one at level two. I'm gonna keep working on this one that's at level two. Definitely get this thing before. Okay, great. So that's two activities that we have at level four. And now I'm gonna buy uh let's buy this old program. And I'm gonna start working on that. get that to level four? I think I can. There we go. That's level four and I still have 11 energy left. Uh, so let me look at my my calendar. Uh, but looking at this, my academics are at level four. My tech arts are at level five. I'm exceeding the uh, requirements in both of these things. I can assign a level five electronics letter. Uh, and um, I'm really well prepared to uh, to get all of these uh, badges if I if I enroll at Technical Academy. Um, tuition is a hundred, and I have more than that. So um, I'm gonna go ahead. And I'm gonna apply to this right now, just uh, so that uh, I have. Uh, I, because I I'm I, I feel really well prepared for it, and then I'm gonna look at community college. Community college. I actually uh, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, apply here as well, uh, just as another backup. But um, but really my backup school is gonna be trade school because uh, I already got in there. Um, and uh, I will definitely have at least ten dollars after enrolling. Um, so now the only badge that I would have to complete is this academics at level five. So right now I don't have a lot of energy left. But with my last point, I will go into this, and um, that's good. That's all of my energy. Looking at the calendar, uh, I. Um, actually don't have any more deadlines that I need to meet. I'm, I'm really well prepared for everything. Uh, the only things that I need to do are uh, to come back on Sunday uh, after uh, two o'clock in the morning after this deadline passes so that I can see whether or not I got into Technical Academy. Uh, and um, if I if I did, then uh, I'm I'm all ready to enroll there, and I'll get all of these badges. Uh, and if not, then um, I'll enroll at trade school and keep working on my academics to make sure that that is uh, I can I can earn all of those badges. Uh, but I I prepared really well uh, for Olivia and. Um, it's paying off. Uh, these last couple of days, I don't have a lot that I have to do. So I'm actually, I don't, I'm, I'm not going to come back tomorrow. I'll come back on Sunday sometime uh, after uh, 2 a.m. Uh, <laughs> sometime on Sunday during the day and um, uh, see how this, uh, this, Technical Academy uh, worked out, but I'm feeling good about it. I feel like I'm really uh, well prepared for it. Um, Okay, so uh, now it's Sunday afternoon. Uh, let's look at our calendar. Um, and uh, all of the deadlines have passed. So let's look at the, our mailbox. This is the one that I really want to see. Olivia was accepted into Technical Academy. Uh, and... Um, uh, for that, uh, she's absolutely going to enroll. That's her dream school. 
Um, and then she earns uh, pride points for earning the badges theoretically grounded. Uh, highly recommended. Uh, let's see, is there a third uh, school that she should get? Or a third uh, one of these? Three. So she may have already gotten that somehow. Let's take a look at this. And then I also, she also gets a pride point for um, getting into being accepted at community college, even though she's not going to attend there. Um, so that's uh, that should be it. We look at Olivia's locker. Um, she will be attending Technical Academy. Uh, she applied to four colleges and was accepted to all four of them. Good job, Olivia. Uh, way to be really, really well prepared. Um, uh, and she's earned these two badges. And uh, she's also earned all three of the badges at her, uh, at her chosen school. Um, so this was a very, very successful week. And uh, if we come back tomorrow, then um, uh, there will be a new character uh, that is presented to us. And, and we can start over and have uh, another week of um, deadlines to try to get them through. Uh, I hope that you've enjoyed this and, and you've learned something about uh, Mission Admission. Um, and uh, uh, that you get a chance to go and play it for yourselves. Um, thank you very much.